My eyes are having a hard time processing it. You think this is what it looks like when you die? Bro, imagine going in there off some Super Mario's. Boy. Ha <laughs> ha. Ha ha. Let me tell you something, chat. We got to watch the Mr. Beast because I'm not going on a $1 vacation next week, but I'm also not going on a $250,000 vacation. I'm going on Carnival next week, chat. So I'll, I'll live stream. If y'all want me to live stream on the boat, y'all let me know. Uh, we won't be doing no reactions. It'll be more IRL. Go with me to the buffet type beat. But let's see what these vacations is hitting for. In this video, we're going on a $250,000 vacation. Look at that pool. This is beautiful. How is this real? <laughs> and I'm going to show you the difference between this and a $100,000 presidential vacation. Right this way, sir. A $50,000 vacation where we have the Eiffel Tower completely to ourselves. I'm holding on for dear life. All the way down to this $1 vacation. That's a one. Hey, it's a beach. A freaking bungalow. I'll take it. Right over here, boys. I'll this shack it. is our vacation. You can see. You was blowing in the bottle. I had to. Like when I when I filled this up with like tea, I had to blow in the bottle to like sip the tea, bro. That's the only thing. The inside of it. There's no walls, Jimmy. Well, I mean, there's walls. This is gross. And in case you don't believe me, it's a dollar. Look at that. Oh, it's 93 cents. You're a liar. I rounded up to a dollar. For one dollar, we get this bed, which is honestly just a mattress sitting on wood planks, a broken cabinet, a light that sort of works. Oh, look at that. Okay. And lastly, random noises coming from your ceiling. I was hearing noise in the room, and there's a raccoon on our roof. I feel like most people would be mad if their hotel room had a raccoon, but for some reason, we're happy. When's checkout time? Tomorrow. Uh, Keep in mind that later in this video, we're going on a $100,000 vacation, a $250,000 vacation. Can we just jump cut to that already? No, because we got to suffer so they can compare our suffering to our happiness. They do like when we suffer. Are we all supposed to fit on the single bed? If we wanted four beds, that'd be $4. First, let's get all the sand Wait. off. Oh, no! oh, we're here. It's lit. <laughs> oh, man. The ra I see a raccoon jump on me. I'm sorry. Listen. We not having chicken for dinner. We having, we cooking coons. We're cooking coons. That's what we're doing. Now, somebody's probably going to clip that out of context and think, you know, but you could clearly see the raccoon on the screen, man. All right. I don't know what else that word could mean. It's, it's short for raccoons, in my opinion. Raccoon just ran in here. I'm going to act like I didn't scream like a, a little girl. <laughs> Up next, a vacation that's 10,000 times more expensive. Welcome to the $10,000 a night vacation. Whoa, oh my God. Yo, this is night. sick. Wait, what the heck is this? <laughs> this hotel room has jellyfish. Okay, that's so unnecessary. Oh, there's a pool outside. It's a private pool. Does oh, this tough. not look like a scene from a movie? Your hotel room walks out to the beach. Wow. Is this our own private beach? Oh my gosh. This is incredible. Drake, since when is water this fire. I don't know. This all-inclusive vacation also has a giant spa. Oh, yeah. A park filled with flamingos. Oh, they're fighting. Oh. Flamingos. And unlimited room service. OK, what do you need? All of it. <laughs> the only negative of this place is it doesn't have a raccoon. Hey, little guy. But I don't blame them for that. When you spend $10,000 at this resort, we each get our own floor of the building. It looks exactly like Jimmy's, except for I got the top floor. Oh, I have a hammock. I think I can make it in the hammock without getting wet. <laughs> I did it. Yo, look at your view. Chris! Hey! Ow! I caught it! Three, two, one! Hey! Yes, sir! All right, let me lay out some rules. Rule number one. Yeah. No, no throwing. more throwing pillows in my pool. I rule number two. Sorry, Tariq. And now what the hotel is known for. This insane infinity pool that- That is in- Chat. Chat. You get you give me some spicy candy and we out in that pool in the sun? Boy, I'm never coming back. Y'all would never see my face again. That extends over our own personal beach. How does the water just not overflow? I have so many questions. I feel like a father that took his kids on vacation and is just watching them hang out in the pool. Ah! Ah! The $10,000 vacation has been insane, but not as insane as our next vacation all the way across the planet. And now the $50,000 vacation in Paris. Whee! Okay. Our $50,000 vacation starts with a completely private luxury ferry ride. What is that? That's the engine. Bro, what is this, 1805? Tariq, 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 <laughs> zoom in on that guy. He's filming us. Hey! <laughs> they went back. Do you have a YouTube channel? <laughs> I, 
I don't think he speaks English. This vacation comes complete with fantastic food. You'll be wet all day. Me too, you know, me too. Yeah. A tour of the entire... Frog, yo, chat. He speaks English. This vacation... Now, I'm not gonna lie. I have frog legs two times in my life. The first time... Sorry, I'm about to throw up because... Uh, the, se uh, the second time was so bad. All right. First time I had frog legs. Vietnamese frog legs. Bussing, all right? Better than chicken. I would, listen, I would take a plate of those over chicken any day. But then I went to New Orleans, the home of the worst food in the world, okay? And I had frog legs down there. It was butts. So bad. It comes complete with fantastic food, a tour of the entire city. All right. And a luxury hotel room with an amazing view. This is kind of romantic, huh? Yeah. You and Chandler should kiss. And lastly, <laughs> we have a very expensive surprise. So you guys are probably wondering. It's a fifty thousand dollar vacation, and we clearly haven't spent fifty grand yet. No. Yeah. Where Where is it? It's behind you. What do you That's mean? the Eiffel Tower. Yes. We have the entire Eiffel Tower completely to ourselves. Wait, actually? Yeah. What portion of the fifty grand was the tower? Almost all of it. <laughs> no. We are at the Eiffel Tower. This feels like we're sneaking in. No, I'm not joking. It's ours. No one else is here. We can just go straight through the line. This feels illegal. Most of the time, this place is packed with people. And because we have the whole thing completely to ourselves, we're going to try oh, wow. to get to the top of the tower. I'm talking the very top. Boys, enough playing around. Let's head up. On the way up, we stopped at the first floor, over 187 feet in the air, where we had a world-class restaurant all to ourselves. So keep I love how even though we have the entire Eiffel Tower, they still put us in a corner of the restaurant. <laughs> That's the elevator coming from the top of the Eiffel Tower. That looks terrifying. Open Sesame. Yeah, Thank I've you. seen this on I can Russia. see my house from up here. We're in France. I can see my hotel from up here. <laughs> Look how high up we are. Oh, my ears are popping. What are we working with here? Oh my god. You can see the whole city from here. Dude, this is crazy. Tree. Look how much higher we have to go. That's Bro, crazy. this is never gonna end. I'm not gonna lie, I thought we were already at the top. <laughs> We're going up. Now we're heading to the top. At one point, this was the tallest building in the world. Should I jump right now? No, do not move. Come on, boys, follow me. From here on out, there's no more elevators, just stairs. Oh, it's windy up here. We are high up there. Oh, oh my God. Oh, my no. God. No. Nope. Oh. Bro, chat, I went to the top of a building in New York, and they had a glass balcony where, like, not even glass like you walk out onto. Like, glass, like, you step on it, you look straight down, and you see the ground. Boy, almost pooped on myself, no cap. Don't drop the camera. We are standing over 900 feet in the air. The highest point civilians are allowed on the tower. But since it's ours We're for the civilians. night, I had one last surprise. What do you think's behind this door? Stairs. How'd you, did I, how'd you know? We can see the stairs. Well, yes, there are more stairs, but this takes us to the very top where no one's allowed to go. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. Bro. Oh my God. Are we allowed on that? I don't know. Oh, oh, that is scary. The ledge just comes up to my waist up here. I'm holding on. Boy, I, look, look for, ladies, I don't know what y'all feel when y'all, but when I'm at heights, I get like this feeling in my, 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 my baby holder. Okay. You know what I'm saying? And it's just like this tingling that starts to happen. I could feel it looking at this video chat for dear life. I completely understand why tourists are not allowed up here. We have a cameraman on the other side of the city with a lens zoomed in on us. He's over a mile away. If this lens is good enough, you should be able to see us waving. For a $50,000 vacation, you gotta admit this is cool. This is amazing. It's a once in a lifetime it's experience. Cool. Are you ready for the best moment yet? I don't know why a YouTuber has this much power, but lights! Oh, there we oh, go. Oh, that's fire. <laughs> Like a disco show. Oh, oh. I heard like to record that is like illegal though. Like it's like copywritten to, to record the light show. Ow. Guys, I don't know if this next command's gonna work, but turn every light off. Oh, oh. oh wow. It's pitch black. Oh. The Eiffel Tower went dark. That's what are crazy. these millions of French people thinking right now? They should get me off this tower. I don't know why they gave me this much control. 
Next, we head to Switzerland for the $100,000 vacation. But this is no ordinary vacation. This hotel has two inch thick bulletproof windows, a panic button that will lock down the entire building and is riddled with security because this is a hotel where world leaders and presidents take their vacation. And also the side men were in town, so I decided to invite them as well. Oh, oh my God. It smells like food in here. We've got the whole ocean in there. What? This is nuts. This wow. is the most expensive penthouse suite in all of Europe. It covers the whole eighth floor and has dozens of rooms, tons of staff waiting on you all day and night and absolutely crazy. Yo, 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 listen. For Right now, I don't know who the next president gonna be, but Joseph Biden, okay? Joey Biden, give me a job, man. Take me, look, let me, let me be a photographer, a videographer for the night. When you, when you head over to Switzerland, I'm trying to see this hotel. Did you see that seafood they had? Last time I ate seafood was in New Orleans. I almost threw up. All right, puked my brains out. I'm in need of some quality seafood, man. Food everywhere. Want a hit? Yeah, get a hit of that. Waiting on you. That was some big old meat back there. You all day and night, and absolutely crazy food everywhere. That is some big meat, all right? Thing a little thick right there. Want a hit? Yeah, get a hit of that. Oh, yeah. How do these guys compare to your normal guests? Yeah. <laughs> so you'd say they're pretty dumb. <laughs> <laughs> and like I said before, some of the most powerful world leaders choose this place for their vacation. Even Bill Sound Clinton stayed here, and he wasn't assassinated. Sam how are you my thick king that's crazy you know what i'm saying it's pretty safe <laughs> in terms of security here you have the bulletproof windows even this this is bulletproof oh my it feels thick oh, pretty <laughs> solid man. i hope pretty i'm good. a president yeah also some snipers that we can put on the rooftop you have your own sniper <laughs> are you able that's to crazy. negotiate on behalf of the sidemen i can try my best yes uh, this will help me in my negotiation i'd like to buy 10 percent how much, boys? No, you, the guy you say. Yeah. 200 million, Jimmy. 200 million. All right, to the panic button. <laughs> oh, no. I'm not going to lie. I've been waiting to press this button since we got here. We all agree this is a good idea. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Carl, you're Bill Clinton and you feel threatened. Press the panic button. All right, he pressed it. Oh, wait, I see a door closed. Wait, are we locked in? Is it locked? Are you guys in there? Is that Nolan? Yeah. And the door's like shut. I walked off for one second. Which button uh, opens it? You don't get to panic and then open it. <laughs> they should push the button now, the police will come, and there's a big fine. Don't press it again. <laughs> I've been thinking, how would a president get somewhere like McDonald's? Let's see how presidents travel. Come on in. It turns out when you're the president, you have to go everywhere with your bodyguards, so that means when you drive... Oh, we got like a oh, motorcade. Oh, we got an entourage. Okay. How do we know which car to get into? On the third, on the fourth. Ideally, the third or fourth, he said. Which car is the most dangerous? The first one. Nolan, you should ride in the first one. I can do that. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Who wants to ride with me? Harry, come on in. Harry Chandler. I'm sure the president doesn't sit in the middle. Typically, you guys would be my bodyguards, but, you know, you'll suffice. Just squeeze in, mate. Squeeze <laughs> in. The whole president is going to McDonald's. Does your window roll down? Hey, how's it going? No, now I'm going to get shot. Oh, now I'm going to no. get shot. Oh, I can't believe we can do this. This is nice. Turns out when you travel in a presidential motorcade, a lot of people... And this is only $100,000? No, nah, no, nah, I'm saying only like... I... Right, listen, listen. We're not balling like that, but... This is a lot for a hundred deals. Start to notice you. How's it going? <laughs> this is punkers, man. I thought we just drawing the attention of everyone. People are filming like with the president. This is weird. Which made McDonald's a little awkward. <laughs> Excuse us. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind our security. Jimmy, does this beat out the Eiffel Tower for you? Depends how good these nuggets are. Obviously, all the vacations so far have been amazing, but they pale in comparison to this next one. Our final vacation too. is once again all the way across the planet. Probably. And now we're in Japan for the two- Japan! But chat, chat, this is my biggest dream, bruh, is to go to Japan. We're gonna get there, okay? We're gonna get there. I wanna go to Japan next summer. We gotta do it. Now, will I be spending 250000 of course not. You know what I'm saying? I would never spend that much money unless I was paying to bring y'all with me. You know what I'm saying? But got to make it to Japan next summer. Chat, that's the goal. $150,000 vacation. And we're meeting up with a special guest here, so you're going to want to watch to the end. To start off our vacation, we dropped off our bags at the most expensive hotel in all of Japan. This is gigantic. I have an echo in a hotel room. And afterwards, we felt like getting to know the city of Tokyo. Now we're going to drive Mario Karts on that's the street. That's crazy. <laughs> We rented private Mario Karts where we literally get to drive on the streets of Japan. People are just staring at us. This Johnny is not Sins? meant to be on the that? street. There's real cars driving right beside me. Well, look how many people are crossing the street here. This is the busiest crosswalk in the world, and we're driving right through it. 
Oh, we're on go karts in Tokyo. Going fast. Bro, I love Japan. This place is crazy. When we arrived at our next destination, we met with Master Swordman Yoshioki Somita. He's been training with the katana for the last 26 years, and he actually agreed to give us a rare lesson in the art of the samurai. Now we each got our own katanas Where's and the Corey lessons Kenshin began at, with man? swinging techniques. It was not as easy as we thought. So. No! No, they're gonna zoom in on it. Then it was my turn. Boys, you think I'm gonna be able to do this? Yes. Yeah, you got it. Okay. Hey. hey! Let's see how the boys do. Okay. Whoa. Who am I? And then our samurai teacher gifted us this insane katana. I don't deserve this, but thank you. And because this is a quarter million dollar vacation, we mm. rented out the most premium sushi chef in the world. The along with sushi this conveyor belt restaurant. restaurant. They got Louis Vuitton coasters. Oh the chef makes all the food. You spent a year in Japan? Bruh, bruh, bruh. Go ahead, you know, plug me in, man. Wait, wait, wait. Use your context. Put it right next to our table. And getting to see a <laughs> chat. I started eating octopus. I'm, I might be a different person now, man. I don't know. I don't know what it is, but th th this look fire to me. Master at work was one of the coolest dining experiences ever. Oyster. Listen, chat. Uh, oysters are aphrodisiac, okay? If you don't know what that is, go learn about it. You eat a couple oysters, take you a Topo Chico. You in the building, man. You in the building. Woo! Mm. Wow. Oh my god. Oh. They said we could He's use the first tuna. Here you go, little man. What? See how we caught him in air? And once we paid the bill, thank you. <laughs> we were off to the craziest place I've ever been. Alright, follow me. I rented insane. this whole place. But before we see it, socks off. This is basically an art museum, but for experience. What? Yo, what is the name of this place? Chat, we gotta go. We we gotta start a fundraiser today. Alright? Hopefully that fundraiser only consists of people watching the video, sharing them, you know what I'm saying? Not using ad blocker, things of that nature. But what? Whoa. Whoa. Oh my God. I have goosebumps. My eyes are having a hard time processing it. You think this is what it looks like when you die? Bro, imagine going in there off some Super Mario's. Boy. Ha <laughs> ha. Let me tell you something, chat. I might never come out. All right, might never. Probably. I'm gonna I'm be in the, 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 the dimensions with Doctor Strange. Wait, what is this oh next row? <gasps> Normally, this place is completely full of other people, but we secured the place entirely for ourselves. This might be one of the best things we've ever done. Dude, are these fish? We're in a pool in a museum playing with animated fish. This is the most unique thing you could ever do on a vacation. Wait, the fish are surrounding us. Look, how did they know to surround us? They love us. They're going everywhere now. Now you're all probably hungry, which is why we're at this restaurant that is ran by robots. What? My name? Yo, chat, y'all coming to Japan with me. We got to We got to do it. We got to do it. We have to. Miss right? Pepper. Can we have a seat, Pepper? Sure. Let's. Holla Squad goes to Japan. Starting a million dollar GoFundMe right now, chat. We have to. Find a comfortable spot. We reserved the entire place. So the only other people here were the robot waiters. Food robots here. Wait, so the food is delivered on a robot? An oddly fluffy robot. Pepper's staring really hard at Chandler He's for some reason. Pepper does not like Chandler. Bro, I did Pepper's nothing to you. <laughs> Everyone, make sure you eat tons of food because tomorrow I rented an entire theme park and PewDiePie is going to be there. Which is really crazy. You see, PewDiePie and I have a long history. Mr. Beast, I was wondering when you would show up. <laughs> <laughs> we helped him in his subscriber race against T-Series. Grab your phone, go on YouTube, search PewDiePie and subscribe to him. Eventually, we even caught up to him. Mr. Beast has hey. taken over me in subscribers. I guess I'm getting a taste of my own medicine. That's all right. He definitely deserves it. And even though we've been friends for a while we've Japan never vlog. actually met in person Day and because this is week? such a okay. long way to meet up i rented this entire amusement park this is fuji q highland the park with the scariest rides in all of japan it usually has thousands of people waiting in line but as per usual i rented the entire oh, and they got the it usually has thousands of people waiting in line but as per yo America count your day. No, nah, I'm joking. I'm joking. America, listen, I'm here to stay. You know what I'm saying? I will visit, though. Gotta visit. What is this? For usual, I rented the entire thing just for us. You can ride whatever ride you want. 
I wasn't done, but he left. I'm about to go on this entire roller coaster alone. You what you're seeing here is the steepest there? roller coaster drop in the world. Are you scared? Yes! Have fun! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I'm scared for him. <laughs> nah, that's and crazy. like promised, the father of YouTube, PewDiePie, met us in the park. A little later than planned because I texted him the wrong day. Sorry, Felix. And he wanted to ride the craziest coaster at the park. Why are you scared? I'm so scared of roller coasters. This one, doesn't, this one doesn't spin at all. I'll ride it if Felix rides it. Let's go! I'm terrified. <laughs> Mr. Be scared of roller coasters. If I die on this roller coaster, you guys are gonna feel terrible. You take your shoes off? Anything that could fly out. That's how you know it's bad. <laughs> they don't even trust us with shoes on this ride. You got this. You'll be fine. I did not. This was my worst nightmare. I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't want to do this. You're scaring me. Come down. <laughs> oh. Whatever you do, don't throw up. I'm terrified. Can we pick a better one? We could have picked a nice, comfortable ride. I actually have no idea what it is. At some point, there is a literal 90 degree drop. <laughs> You're freaking me out. <laughs> what did you sign me up for? You brought me here. Well, what we didn't know was. Quick no! Bat, yo, they got me clapped. They got me clapped. Boy, ain't no way. <laughs> Ain't no way. This ride goes backwards. Why are we going backwards? Son, and the chair spin. Oh, nah, Japan, y'all got that. All right, now nah, we all let you eat a Reese, all your museums. <laughs> no. Did I do this? Oh my God, we're upside down. Damn it! Oh! This is crazy! Best roller coaster ever! Oh my gosh, Felix, what did we just do? I'm crying. Best roller coaster ever. I've got tears just running. Let's <laughs> well, good meeting you, Jamie. I'm gonna head out. Yeah. We screamed at the first That's little crazy. bump. <laughs> what? Thank you. Those onions. I don't think I've ever <laughs> had a chewy potato before. <laughs> oh, potato. That's okay. what you get for passing me. What you <laughs> uh, Felix, I'm sorry for passing you. You don't have to threaten me with violence, so. I'm good. Yeah, they are good. That was the $250,000 vacation. Felix, can you transition us? Bro fish. Come on now. Uh, th this video is very inspiring. Shout out to Mr. Beast, you know what I'm saying? Definitely got to take my vacation to 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 J J, J, J Pan. Man, got got to got to make it out there. All right, I seen enough. I seen that food on that boat. I seen the museum chat. I'm a I'm I'm a big brain. I'm a big brainer, man. I, I like I like things that make my brain go. Oh my god, you know what I'm saying? And that museum's definitely gonna do it. Definitely got to take some Super Mario's with me. Might take some some Super Trees. All right. Now, if you don't know what a super tree is, a super tree is um, it's a tree with superpowers, all right? And um, yeah, we're just gonna stay right there so we can keep the monetization, right? You know what I'm saying? 